Well, all right, tubers. Freaking right. I had to recharge the battery. So it's a new day down here in the shop. It's it's the next day. Look at my plants. Look at my plants. I hope everybody goes uh, and checks out the uh, Dicker Deckle deal on Cyber Monday. Don't forget that. Uh, you Dizzy got a new a new sticker up there. It's a plant sticker. You guys got to check that out. So I thought I'd let you see what I did here. Um, I made a gas pedal. I know I showed it in the last video, but I thought I'd show it to you how it works. Alright, here's the gas pedal. Put my foot on it. Look at that, huh? Quiet, doesn't make any noise. Oh yeah, oh, so it's just perfect for the foot, and there's the brake and the gas, so you see that, boom, boom, that's why I kind of had it over that side, just so, you know, it was comfy for your foot, so that's, uh, and that goes down pretty fast, so it should work out pretty good, I'm proud of that, so I've been cleaning up some more of this motor today. which is uh, a project that black don't want to come off the parts that it, it was uh, not sticking to it came right off no problem but the other parts it was sticking to don't want to come off at all and the top here has got all that nasty stuff all over I may take that apart and clean all that with the brush wheel or something but it's so hard to get down in these fins and you know the you dizzy shop i don't have i don't have the proper tools to do these jobs i just wing it all the time you know so that's pretty cool you know see the tie is quiet now see the tie is quiet now yeah so i'm gonna weld this plate on today and uh finagle with that And uh, just do some more tinkering around in the shop. So that's what the, the thing looks like. It came out really nice. It works awesome, even sitting in the cot. So that's meant. Freaking right. And if that spring goes, I'll show you guys my spring collection. Look at that. You think I got enough springs? I got them all different sizes. I got them this size. I got them this size. I even got them this size. So, even got little ones. So, I got a bunch. Freaking right. That's what's going on here. This is all HO Motorsports parts that I'm gonna give him with the with the go-kart frame and his steering wheel. There's this frame hanging back up. Waiting for him on Sunday. Freaking excited. I just wanna say, HO Motorsports, you my friend, are gonna be the first tuba to ever come to the U Dizzy shop. You know, so that's pretty freaking cool, you know? Gotta like that kind. I don't know if I'm gonna get this video up before he comes. Cause let's see, it'll probably be yeah, it'll probably go up on Sunday morning, this bit here right here. Uh I put one up today, I put one up yesterday, I got one to go up tomorrow. And uh then we'll go from there. So my next video after this one probably is gonna be uh the HO Motorsports visit to the U Dizzy shop, so that's going to be pretty cool. So I want to tell everybody, I know this isn't a long video today, but uh, don't forget the Dicker Dackle deal. Don't forget the Big Pig Race over there at Pub One, so everybody go check that out. Don't forget to go check out my friend uh, One Tough Dog, you know. 
Tyler Hamilton, homeboy. That's what's up. And uh, small engine vids. He's a good dude. Go check him out. So comment, like, subscribe. Check out the links below. Hit the Cyber Monday sale at the uh, at the old uh, You Dizzy Swag. Down the links in the description below. I don't know how to do all this, put it on a video stuff like Pug does. I'm not that good yet, but I'll get there. So, freaking cheat it. All right, peace out. There's some of my supplies right there. Freaking right. All right, so what we got going on here? Oh, you guys know what this bucket is? Oh, the old tap and die. You know, look at this. This one right here. Oh, yeah so what I did here is with the uh, throttle cable what I did was I put it in the uh, old vicey and uh, let's see I took this here and uh, drilled and tapped a hole on this here on this bolt here so this will fit in there on that so now I'll show you what that's all for let see, I'll put this back in here. And now we'll take this out. Oh. Okay. Now what I got going on over here is a whole nother story. What I did was I, I put a, a clamp here. So you can see it that's gonna go to that peg so I'll put you down and we'll uh, try to do that so what I got here is this cable that comes through and pops underneath this you see that it goes right underneath there and then it comes up and connects onto this This doesn't seem to be as easy as I made it out to be. Eh? Okay. Seems to be the problem here. Yeah? Isn't that cool? It doesn't grab. Nice. Think this screw's too big. Doesn't want to work for me. Doesn't want to work. Just doesn't want to work. The screw just wants to come back out. I thought I had a plan going on here. Surprise, surprise, I didn't. Alright, so let me try another screw. Okay, tubers, let's uh, try this again. What I did here is I have this, and I put a different a different screw in it, and I re-tapped it with a bigger hole, 
because uh, that little one wasn't catching. So I'm going to loop it underneath this, the plastic, pull it all the way up tight to this, and then I will put this right on the brake. I mean, the brake, I keep calling it that, it's the gas. And then tighten this screw down. Right there. And then, she'll be good. Beautiful. Now all I gotta do is drill uh, the other hole on on this side to lock this down, and she'll be all set. And then that'll be uh, the uh, the throttle is locked on there, nice. Oh yeah, once this thing is tight, it'll hold that plastic there, and it'll stay there. But very, very, very cool. Not bad for a, a wacko blind dude, huh? Made his own little gas pedal there. Look all right. So then the rest of this here will uh, go underneath here and tuck underneath the seat and go right to the back. I have, uh, whew, look at how long it is. I have plenty of wire here plenty of it so that's beautiful that's another day you dizzy shop pretty cool I was gonna use this I was gonna try to use this here and I was gonna try to thread thread the end of this and just put a nut on the end but that is hot and steel and I couldn't do it because I'm a wussy so now I'm just going to drill the other hole there, and uh, we'll go from there. Freaking right. Yo, all right. So, I was working over here again, and look at that. I got it clipped down right where it's supposed to go. I got it connected there. I got the uh, <coughs> lock-in screw on there, so that's freaking mint. Now I just got to uh, got to run back there. I just got to tuck it under the seat and uh, connect it to the motor when I get the motor on there. If you noticed here, I did some welding here. This plate's uh, solid as can be. Welded. Uh, I plug welded these holes. I welded underneath. I welded here. I welded there. I welded there. I welded underneath there so she's all all good now now I just need to finish up that motor and uh, get that on there so we have a gas and a brake we got four wheels the steering's all loose now fix that all up I still got to put some air in the tires and throw a motor on her and she's ready to go got the chain all set I found a nice chain for number 41 chain so it ain't gonna snap and break you know we don't want a cheap chain on there so that's awesome so I'm gonna need a couple things for this motor probably all the the metal kit for it you know the tins and uh, I'm gonna need the pull the pulley here and um, one tough dog said he's gonna hook me up with one of these here uh, because this end here just keeps flying right off. I don't think it even goes to this one, to be honest with you. But uh, that's what's going on. And I found out this is the, the where that hose goes to the carburetor from the carburetor, right? Onto here. So that's pretty cool. I figured that out um, from this spot here, right? From right here goes to here, correct? the mundo okay well if you notice I clean that all up really nice you know so that's pretty awesome and this is all back together looking sweet too oh yeah that was in the last video great
So you see it again. Take that. <laughs> yeah. So we're getting there. I got to get this finished because I got to get it out of here. I got to sell it to somebody or something uh, because uh, I got no room. So uh, comment, like, subscribe. Check out the links below. Thanks for coming to the U Dizzy shop. Don't forget Cyber Monday. You Dizzy swag. Unless the sale's over. <laughs> so, uh, freaking right. Cheers. Hi, Cole. Oh, I was going to show you. I got mine on, too. See? I'm wearing my dackles, too. Look at my appliance today. Here's a, here's a appliance shot for you. Oh, yeah. He's appliancing up today. So, choo-choo. I'm going to have to get a haircut. What do you guys think? <laughs>